good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever Hi. you are. I hope you have are having an amazing day. It is Tuesday, January 28, 2014, and these are the facts of the matter. Ever have a tough time accepting the grace of God for your life? Do I have news for you? Consider a couple of classic failures and how God graciously dealt with them. Abraham. God tells him that his 90-year-old wife is going to bear a child. Genesis chapter 17 verse 16. And I will bless her and give thee a son also of her. Yea, I will bless her and she shall be a mother of nation. King of kings of people shall be of her. Abraham falls on his face and laughs, literally, mocks, scorns, saying, Will Sarah bear a child? Genesis 17, 17. Then Abraham fell upon his face and laughed and said in his heart, Shall a child be born unto him that is a hundred years old, and shall Sarah that is ninety-nine years old bear? In the following chapter, God says to Abraham, He will surely become a great and mighty nation, and in him all the nations of the earth will be blessed, for I have chosen him. Genesis 18:18. 18, 18. Seeing that Abraham shall surely become a great and mighty nation, and all the nations of the earth shall be blessed in him. That is the grace of God. Sarah. God named Sarah Princess. You, Abraham, shall call her Sarah, literally, princess. Genesis chapter 17, verse 15. Sari's name is changed, and she is blessed. And God said unto Abraham, As for Sari, thy wife, thou shalt not call her name Sari, but Sarah shall be her name. Shall her name be. <laughs> God tells Abraham, Turn that down, please. God tells Abraham that within a year, Sarah will bear a son. Genesis eighteen ten, And he said, I will certainly return unto thee according to the time of life. And lo, Sarah thy wife shall have a son. And Sarah heard it in the tent door, which was behind him. Sarah, who is within earshot, also laughs. Shall I indeed bear a child when I am so old? Genesis chapter 18, verse 12 and 13. Therefore Sarah laughed within herself, saying, After I am waxed old, shall I have pleasure, my Lord being so my Lord being old also? And the Lord said unto Abraham, Wherefore did Sarah laugh, saying, Shall I sure, certainly bear a child which am I which am old? Imagine God named Sarah Princess with a full knowledge that she will soon mock has promised to give her a son. That is the grace of God. It is obvious that God, in his great love and grace, chooses and uses less than perfect people. People who are in the process of becoming. So the next time you are inclined to write yourself off as an unqualified candidate for his grace keep in mind blundering Abraham and Sarah and God's grace in dealing with them where sin increase grace abound all the more Romans chapter 5 verse 20 moreover the law entered and the offense might abound but where sin abound Grace did much more abound. And those are the facts of the matter for January, Tuesday, January 28, 2014. Peace be in you, my brothers and sisters. And the grace of God is around us all. May the Lord have mercy on us all. I love you guys. God bless.